past couple of weeks, we've had the opportunity to talk about the relationships that uh, we share in life. We've talked about the relationships that mean the most to us, particularly with those in our own families. We've talked about relationships that we have tried to establish and maintain with our friends. Uh, this week we're talking about our relationship with God. And there's no way to talk about how we relate to the, to the God who loves and created us without talking about how we relate to everything else God creates and maintains. And so we see ourselves invested in the world and in God's people everywhere. One of the historic ways in which this church has invested itself is through the ministry of the Potter's House. It's, it's right next door, but it could be it could be a world away in terms of the hungry and the desperate who come through those doors and simply look for someone to relate to them the love that God holds. One of the uh, working premises that we've had for this sermon series is that relationships are, uh, are similar to traffic cones. Uh, they show up as you're driving down the road and they kind of confuse us a little bit, but, but they're placed there to help direct our path and uh, to help keep us safe. Um, and so we've approached that both, with, as Ted was saying, with our relationships with our family, with our friends, and now with our relationship with God. On Sunday, uh, one of the things we're talking about, you know, there are some relationships that uh, don't require much of you. Uh, you can just say, uh, yeah, I know so-and-so or whatever, but, but a relationship with God, an authentic relationship with God through Jesus Christ, uh, does require something from each of us. Um, we receive so much, but it requires something of us in return. So this Sunday, as a celebration Sunday, we celebrate all the wonderful things that God's doing here uh, through this community of faith and in your life. Uh, we'll be talking about how it is that God directs and shapes us uh, to be faithful witnesses for His kingdom in this world. So we'll be saving a seat for you Sunday. We're looking forward to it. Uh, celebration Sunday, we'll be commissioning some Stephen ministers. Uh, we've got a couple of baptisms scheduled, so we hope you'll join us here at Virginia Beach United Methodist Church.